እንዴት ናችሁ የተከበራችሁ የዩቲዩብ ቻናል የበሰቦች ኢትዮ ዩኒቨርሲቲ ኤክስቴክተም ሶሉሽን ሃው ዩቲዩብ ቻናል ነው ኔ መምር ጌታ ሁን ነኝ ከወራይ ተሶዶ ዩኒቨርሲቲ በዚህ ዩቲዩብ ቻናል ለሞጫ ፈጠና የሚሆኑ እና ለምማር ማስተማር ሪፈረንስ የሚሆኑ ጥያቄዎችን እና ቲቺንግ ኦር ቱቶሪያል ማቴሪያሎችን የምታገኙበት ዩቲዩብ ቻናል ነው ሶ ዩቲዩብ ቻናልን ሰብስክራይብ ማድረግ የቻናል የበሰቦ እንድትሆኑና ከቻናል ላይ የተለያዩ ቲፖችን እንድታገኙ ላልደኝ ቪዲዮቹን ከመጀመራችሁ በፊት ላይክ አድርጋችሁ ሲጀምሩ በቪዲዮቹ ላይ ኮሜንት እንድትጽፉና ቪዲዮቹን ለጓደኞቻችሁ ሼር እንድታደርጉ ላልደኝ ከዚህ በፊት በኢኮኖሚክስ መጫፈ ተና ክፍል 1 አስቀምጨላችሁ ነበር ይሄን ክፍል 1 ያላያችሁ በዲስክሪፕሽን ቦክስ ውስጥና በኮሜንት ቦክስ ላይ ፒን አድርገ ፓርት 1 የምታገኙበት ሊንኩን አስቀምጣለሁ ከዛ በቀጥታ ተቀጣጣችሁ ማየት ይችላላችሁ በዚህ ቪዲዮ የኢኮኖሚክስ 2016 የካቲት ወር ላይ የነበረው መውጫ ፈተና ማቴማቲካል ኦር ካልኩሌሽን ፓርቱን ሰርቼላችሁ አመጥቻለሁ ሶ ቪዲዮን ሲጀምሩ ላይክ አድርጋችሁ እንድትጀምሩ ለጓደኞቻችሁ ሼር እንድታደርጉላችሁ አሁን ወደ ጥያቄዎቹ ጎላለሁ next here uh, based on the following information answer the questions answer the questions Suppose a man currently has 38000 bill and he is considering considering taking a new but risky job that will increase his wealth to 50000 per week likely likelihood of 0.6 if it succeed but will reduce his wealth to 20000 per which is probability of 0.4 if it fails the utility level associated with sir 38000 per is 20 and the utility level associated with an income of 20000 per and 50000 per is 15 and 30 respectively so what is the expected utility of the new job a 2245 b 26 c 30 d 24 so uh, similarly here we have a similar question So based on the following information you answer the question and suppose a man currently has 38 bur 38000 bur and he is considering taking a new but risky job that will increase his wealth to 50000 bur which likely would of 0.6 if it's succeed but will he reduce his wealth to 20000 bur which probability of 0.5 for if it fails the utility level associated with 38000 bur is 20 and the utility level associated with an income of 20000 per and 50000 per is 15 and 30 respectively so what is the expected utility of utility of the new job a 22.5 b 26 c 30 d 24 so let's calculate this or let us analyze this problem so here we have given parameters the current wealth is 38000 and well if the job succeed is 50000 with uh, probability of this 0.6 and well if the job fails 20000 uh, uh, with probability of 0.4 and utility level associated with current wealth that means with 38000 bur is 20 and utility level associated with the wealth of 20000 is 15 and the utility level associated with the wealth of 15,000 is 50,000 is this 30. So we are uh, uh, asking to calculate the expected utility of this new job, which is unknown. So how we can analyze this here? To calculate the expected utility of the new job, we first need to calculate the expected utility associated with the possible outcome of taking the job. So here, the expected utility, or this is symbolized by you, is calculated as the weighted average of the utility level associated with each possible outcome where this the weights are the probabilities of those outcomes therefore here we calculate the expected utility as eu which is equal with the probability of success times the uh, uh, utility of success plus the uh, probability of failure times is the uh, utility associated with this either so here this uh, p success is probability of success at 0.6 p 
failure is the probability of failure as 0.4. This U success is utility level associated with values of 50,000 per, which is 30. And uh, U failure is utility level associated with wells of 20,000 per, which is 15. So here, uh, by inserting these values with this uh, formula, simply we can analyze the expected utility of new job. Here, we have given that P of success as 0 0.6 and U of success as 30 here for uh, uh, 50,000 per. And 0 0.6 times 30 plus 0 0.4, which is the, uh, pro the probability of failure associated with this one, uh, uh, this which is 0 0.4 times this, the, uh, the utility level associated with wealth of that of 20,000 per, which is 15. So here, this part, when we multiply uh, 0 0.6 by uh, 30, which is 1.8, and when we multiply this uh, uh, 0 0.4 with this 1.5, which is 6, and when we sum up these values, we get 24. 24. Therefore, the expected utility of new job is 24, and the correct answer for this question is D. So, uh, D is the correct answer. So, with this given specification, the expected utility level of or utility of new job is 24. So, uh, D is the correct answer. Next, so here this is similar question. So uh, here we have uh, we we uh, are uh, ordered to suppose that the firm faces a demand function for its product P, which is zero two minus two Q, and the firm's cost of production and marketing are here C of Q, which is two Q square, and depending on the information, which one of the following output maximizes the firm's total revenue and what is the value of price that maximizes the firm's total revenue respectively. So here, 4 and uh, so 16 at A, uh, 16 and 4 at B, 4 and 24 at C, and 8 and four, uh, 16 at D. So let us solve this question. So here we have given uh, parameters, the demand function which is given as P, which is 2 minus 2Q, and cost function which is given as C of Q, which is 2Q squared. So the total revenue, usually it is symbolized by TR, is given by the product for price, P, and quantity here sold, which is Q. And using demand function to express this price, this total revenue, which is equal to P times Q. This uh, total revenue, which is calculated as P times Q, where this P is the price of the product, and Q is the quantity sold. Therefore, here P we have given. P we have given so uh, total revenue which is 32 minus 2Q this 2Q 32 minus 2Q is P times Q which is 32Q minus 2Q square so when we multiply this this part by Q we obtain 32Q minus 2Q square and then to maximize the, the total revenue we need to find the output level Q so this we have to calculate is the output level Q that maximize the total revenue function. So here we found this total revenue, which is 2Q minus 2Q square. And how we can find this? How we can uh, find this Q? So to find the output level that maximizes the uh, total revenue, we take the derivative of this the total revenue function, this function, with respect to Q, with respect to Q, and uh, setting it equal with zero. So by doing so, we can simply calculate the, the uh, output level. That means Q. So here, uh, the derivative of TR by uh, DQ, which is D into TR is 32Q minus uh, 2Q square by DQ. That means this, uh, when we take the derivative of this part, which is uh, 32, and this part, which is 4Q. So uh, this means 0, which is uh, 32 minus 4Q, which is equal with 0. 32 minus 4Q, which is 0. So this Q, which is equal to 32 over 4, which is 8. So this is the total output level that maximizes the uh, uh, total revenue, which is 8. Q, which is 8. So the output level that maximizes the firm's total revenue is Q is equal to 8. And to find the corresponding price, we have to substitute this Q, which is equal to 8 into 
the demand function, which is given. So here the demand function is P equal to 0 to minus 2 Q, and why we substitute this Q as 4A. So we find this P, which is 0 to minus 2 times 8, which is 16, and we found that P, which is equal to 16. So the price that maximizes the uh, Fermi's total revenue is 16. Therefore, uh, the uh, total output level that maximizes the Fermi's total revenue and the uh, price that maximizes the Fermi's total revenue is 8 and 16 respectively. Therefore, D is the correct answer. Here, the correct answer is this D. Output maximize the total revenue, the Fermi's total revenue, which is 8, and the value of price that maximize the Fermi's total revenue is 16. Therefore, this uh, D is the correct answer. So, this is also D. Okay, next. Suppose that a revenue for a commodity is, uh, is function of commodity sold and given by R of X, which is 400x minus 0.04x square. What is the marginal revenue when 50 units are sold? A 386 unit, B 302 unit, C 398 unit, and D 396 unit. So here's a similar question. This is suppose that the revenue for a commodity is function of commodity sold and given by R of x, which is 400x minus 0.04x square. And we are asked to calculate this the marginal revenue when 50 units are sold. So here A is 386 unit, B is 302 unit, C is 398 unit, and D is 396 units. Therefore, here uh, to analyze this, we have to note the given parameters is the total revenue function is given as R of x, which is 400x minus 0.04x square, and the unit sold, which is given as 50 units. So here, uh, uh, we have to differentiate the total revenue function with respect to x to find the marginal revenue. So marginal revenue calculated in the is it is a ton, the total revenue function with respect to x differentiate marginal revenue. So here, uh, we have given this marginal uh, revenue function at x, which is the, the differentiate or the derivative of this r of x with respect to x, which is d into 400x minus 0.04x squared by dx. So when we are doing so here, when we differentiate this, it becomes 400 minus when we differentiate this, which becomes 2 times this 0.04, which is 0.08x. So this is the uh, marginal revenue equation. This is the marginal revenue equation. Therefore, when the, we evaluate this uh, marginal revenue equation at x is equal to 50, that x is given that is the unit which is sold. So when we calculate or when we insert this x is equal to 50 with in this uh, the marginal uh, revenue equation m or mr into 50 or mr of 50 unit which is 400 minus 0 0.08 into 50. So uh, this marginal uh, revenue at x is equal to 50 or for this 50 units sold is 400 minus when we multiply this part it becomes 4 and 400 minus 4 is 396. Therefore, the marginal revenue when 50 units are sold is 396 units. And the correct answer for this question is also choice D. Therefore, choice D is the correct answer for this question. So this is the correct answer. Here, this is the correct answer. This is the video that I have in part 2 of this economy exit exam of 2016 here at February. And I will come with this part three of this uh, economic uh, exit exam. And until this, stay in touch with me or in my my channel to act, uh, to access this important educational tips and the uh, materials which support your exit exam preparation. Thank you for watching this video and share the video for your friends as well. Don't forget to subscribe my channel and to write constructive comments on my uh, videos. Thank you and have a nice. Exit exam preparation time for you.